Hey kinder friends! Today we're going to be working on a non-fiction text about insects and it is titled Insects by Robin Bernard. Look at that grasshopper on there. The world is full of little creepy crawly things but not all of them are insects. A wiggly worm isn't an insect. A slowpoke snail is not an insect. Even a hairy spider is not an insect. Do you think this animal is an insect? How many body parts do you count? We've got one, two, three. If you counted three, it probably is an insect. Is this an insect? Count its legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. If you counted six, you can be sure it's an insect. Insects are the only animals in the world that have six legs. A grasshopper has six legs. A beetle has six legs. A moth has six legs too. These are all insects. The things that insects can do with their legs and feet might surprise you. A housefly tastes things with its front feet. This insect hears through tiny holes near its knees. A praying mantis uses its strong front legs to hold its prey. A honeybee carries pollen in baskets in the back of its legs. Most insects have wings. Besides birds and bats, insects are the only animals that can fly. Making, uh, flying makes it easier for them to find food. It's a fast way to escape enemies as well. Nearly all insects have two feelers on their heads. They're used for feeling, tasting, and hearing things. Some insects can even smell things with their feelers. Insects have mouth parts that are just right for the food they eat. A butterfly sips nectar. Its mouth is like a straw. A fly soaks up yucky garbage. Its mouth is like a sponge. A grasshopper chews plants. Its mouth is like a pair of scissors. A mosquito sucks blood. Its mouth is like a little needle. Insects are a favorite snack of frogs, birds, and bats. But insects have lots of ways to keep from being eaten. Some insects hide in plain sight. Tree hoppers can fool you. They look like thorns on a stem. A leaf insect looks just like another dry leaf. It's easy to miss a tree bark grasshopper on a tree trunk. Did you know that most insects hatch from eggs? Many baby bugs look like their parents, only smaller. You can tell what they are even before they grow up. Baby milkweed bugs look just like their parents. So do baby roaches. Other insect babies don't look like their parents at all. This caterpillar hatched from an egg too, but when it grows up, it will be a big brown moth. Insects are amazing and they are everywhere. So be careful where you step. You might find a six-legged creature that's more fun to watch than to squash. So today your writing activity is going to be labeling an insect. So first you're going to draw one, then you're going to label the different parts. You can label its eyes, the six legs, the wings, and then the, the three body parts are the head, the thorax, and the abdomen. 
You can also label the feelers or the antennae at the top. We can't wait to see your pictures. Have a great day.